Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, my name is Lauren. I hope that you're all continuing to stay healthy and safe and well in this crazy, crazy time. Um, I'm really excited because I'm gonna show you what fits in this little cute bag right here. I showed this to you last week. Um, this is the Balenciaga extra extra small everyday tote and spoiler alert this is not like an extra extra small tote this can fit so much stuff it's like never ending it's a little black hole of a bag um if you want to see sort of my unboxing and my first initial reaction about this then go check out my last video and for those of you asking about my um code my matches fashion code which i did leave in the description and i will of my last video and i will leave it down below you get 15% off and it's not working for some people and so I think it's because there's only a max of five people that can access the code per day but I have message mat matches and I hope to hear back from them um, to see what's kind of going on because people are getting an error code now. Um, in addition to showing you what fits in here, I am also going to go over my top Louis Vuitton SLGs that I take everywhere with me and so I like transfer out my work bag and my regular bag I'm going to tell you why I think they are the ones that you need to have in your life it, or if you're just starting your Louis Vuitton collection why I think you need these SLGs because they're so amazing so if you want to see what fits in this cute little bag then just stay tuned and I should also say that this does have a long strap. It's just tucked inside the bag right now. It, I can remove it. I did show that in my last video that it does the strap does remove, but I always wear my bag or this bag particularly crossbody. So I just tucked it in here for the sake of the review. So let's go and show you. Right now, there's nothing in there except for, like I said, my strap, which is tucked in. And then I also have my hand sanitizer, which is by Nude Sticks. And it just kind of fits onto like the handle of the bag, which I really like. So let's fill this up. I'm gonna show you my sort of everyday things that I take with me. And then I'll also show you what else can fit into this little thing because it can fit everything. Everything I swear that you need, except for like a laptop. Um, so I'm gonna start with the basics I take with me everywhere. Um, one of, if not my favorite piece from Louis Vuitton, the small SLG, is definitely the six key ring holder. And at first I didn't know if it was necessary, but now I just, I feel like I cannot live without this. And if I were to lose this or lose all my SLGs, this would be the first one I think I would go and repurchase. Um, so I have a whole video dedicated on this, so I will show it, um, or I will link it down below, but I just have my apartment fob, which is there and then I did a little hack so that my key which is also kind of um, big can also can fit um, side by side it wouldn't so I've just done a little attachment there but this has been a lifesaver it's just I don't know there's something about this when I put it into my bag so for example like this one which is just sort of leather on the inside um, I really don't want my keys to be scratching the inside of my bags, um, especially my leather bags, because then what's the point, right? You're just kind of damaging it. So that's why I really like this. It keeps it all nice and protected. I just find it looks clean. I can grab it really easily. Um, because the keys are not loose in my bag, they're not getting tangled or caught on anything else to like my leather wallets. Um, I'm not gonna show you my leather wallet today, but I have a really soft, two really soft leather wallets, one by Gucci and one by Saint Laurent. And um, before I got this, they got, they got scratched. So um, if you wanna protect your leather goods or your leather bags, I definitely say invest in this. I like the six key ring holder because it's a little bit bigger, it fits everything, but they do have the four key ring holder as well. And it's just good. This for me, I feel like is a necessity. So I use this every single day. I'm gonna throw this into the bag there. And then the next one um, is the mini pochette. I love this. Um, this is my little catch-all. So in here I have eye drops, I have hand cream, I have lip balm, I have, let me double check. I have my perfume. Um, I have my husband's spare key for his car. I have uh, band-aids. Like I have everything in this tiny little catch-all. So um, I have taken the items out of this as well and I have used this as just like a little mini wallet but really what I like to do is keep sort of all the necessity, um, like the necessary items that I might need. Eye drops for sure because my eyes get super duper dry. 
Um, so everything I kind of want to always have on hand, I keep in my mini pochette and then I just transfer it from bag to bag. I know that these are really hard to find right now. Um, I got mine by just being on a wait list and it honestly took only about a month to get this. And um, again, I have mine in the Damier Aben. Most of my SLGs are in the Damier Aben print. Um, not for any particular reason, I think, because my original one was in it and I just kind of continued on with that. But I really do love this. I also have, I have a video, I think, on every single SLG here, so I'll link them all down below if you want to see like a more in-depth review of it. But this is the second thing and it's pretty packed. As you can see, it's full. So that's going in. And then this is my clay, the infamous clay, which I feel like all Louis Vuitton lovers have. This was my introduction to Louis Vuitton. I still love this. I keep all my change, which is a ton of change in here. Um, typically, I'll just use this if I'm paying for like small items like coffee or gum or something like that, but I always take this with me everywhere I go or pay parking, right? So this is perfect. It's filled to the max. I still do love this. I did pick up the coin, oh no, what was it? It's like the men's version of this, of the clay almost. Um, and I do use that, but I use that as a mini wallet. This specifically, I just use for coins. I don't like to use this as a wallet because I feel like it's just too small. You can't really sort through different cards easily. So this is specifically just for coins. This always gets transferred over just like that. And then the last Louis Vuitton SLG Essential for me is going to be this right here, which is from the men's side. And this is the coin card holder. This is my wallet. I don't carry a lot. I essentially just use my cards for everything. I feel like I rarely pay with cash, even though I have some. So I just keep my main cards on the outside and then I'll keep like another set of cards on the inside. But for me, this works perfectly for my lifestyle. Like I said, because I don't carry a lot of money or cards or anything like that. I feel like loyalty cards you can just keep on your phone now anyway. So um, this is just perfect. It's just slim. It's functional. It looks really good. I love the pop of the blue. It's in the men's cobalt color. Um, and I really like that it has the silver hardware because it doesn't scratch or tarnish kind of like you could see this one has tarnished and got it's just it looks it looks so it looks well loved because it has been very well loved but I feel like the men's line because it has this silver hardware just always looks perfect and immaculate so this is it here and then that's gonna go in so those are my essentials a hundred percent that I always take and I switch over into um, my different handbags that I'm using and then sometimes, I just wanna show you this because this will fit too. This is not one of my essentials, but this is the um, pochette accessoire and I just have this little clutch um, bag chain on it. This is from Next Fashion, I'll link it down below. Um, there's a coupon code for that if you would like to use it. Um, so I just have this on because I, I always keep it on now. But I was gonna say this fits in and sometimes what I'll do is I'll just use this as a catch-all for these three items. So I have my key holder, my wallet, and my clay in here. And so if I'm switching into a tote bag, I will always put those three items into my posh at SSR just so I know where they are and they don't get lost in that large tote. And if I do really want to, I could just run out and use this kind of as a handheld clutch. But this also fits into this little bag. And so I just have my mini pochette in there right now. And let me throw in the posh at SSR. So I have my mini pochette and the posh pochette SS4 in there like that is still a ton of room like this thing can hold everything so for the sake of it I will put my phone in there as well I typically keep my phone in my back pocket but I will show you that obviously and this is the iPhone 11 it fits in easy peasy um, my mask so this is just an Aritzia mask. This is actually one of the new ones, let me show you. So this is the linen ones. I wear the linen ones at work, so I feel like they're the only ones that really work for me. So this is one of the new linen ones. This is in the color, oh, I don't know how to pronounce it. I just wanna say it's white, but it's like a space, a space. Sorry, I'm butchering it. It's $12, so it's linen. It has the nose 
the uh, wire there, which a lot of them don't have, it has the adjustable ear loops, but it has a lanyard attached to it. So um, I'm wearing makeup right now, but at work, I mean, it doesn't really matter. I would have to tighten these up, but if you have to talk a lot with your job and you're just using the like cloth face masks, I definitely recommend the Aritzia linen ones. And I do like, like I said, that this one has the adjustable nose bridge and it has the lanyard attached because sometimes like during the workday, obviously I wanna take it off and then it just holds it right there. So it's perfect, I really do like it. My friend and um, did make me one of those mask chains and I love it, but sometimes it gets caught in my earrings. This one, because it's so nice and light, doesn't get caught, so. This is such a good mask, I definitely recommend it. If they come out in other colors with the lanyard, I'm gonna buy them all. Okay, so, right, I was gonna show you that the mask fits in there. So, let's put the mask in because that is an essential nowadays. So in goes the mask, and again, I still have room. I'm gonna throw my gum in. I'm gonna throw in some snacks, because I always take snacks with me. These are the Thai strawberries, and they're dried, and they're so good. And I feel like I'm addicted to candy, so this is kind of better than candy, even though this is essentially candy. So we're gonna throw these in. I just don't want my mini pochette to get completely lost. Okay, so now we can see it's getting a little bit kind of warped and heavy, but there is so much stuff in here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take out this Pasha Essessoir and I'm just gonna throw in these three by themselves because the Pasha Essessoir takes up a little bit of extra room. So at that point, when I just put those three sort of in, it fits really nicely in there. You can also fit a water bottle in as well. So let me get my water bottle. So I have my Swell water bottle and it fits. So like I have so much stuff in here and the water bottle fits super duper easy and like I wouldn't normally take the water bottle with me on a daily basis so I just wanted to show you that a swell water bottle and like a regular sort of disposable water bottle would fit in very easily and let me show you this because I have my iPad here and my iPad fits in so if I were going to go to a coffee shop, which I'm obviously not doing. Now I could definitely fit in my iPad. So it's so cute. It's just, oh, it's really just a black hole. It holds so much things. I just, or so many things, that's bad English. Um, it's just, it's such a perfect little handy bag. And I do feel like I did load it up a little bit last week and I did wear the strap and it didn't um, dig into my, shoulder at all i feel like um because the leather on the strap is so sort of soft and malleable that it just sat sat really nicely on my shoulder and it didn't dig in or anything like that so i love this i know it's like maybe it's not for everybody because it says balenciaga right there but i feel like it's small enough to the point or you could even like turn it this way if you didn't want anyone to know what brand it was you could definitely turn it that way but i feel like it's small enough that it's not really sort of loud and in your face um i would definitely recommend this bag i feel like for the price point it's really good it's all leather if that's your thing go for it like i love the fact that it's all leather if you have any other questions, please leave them down below. I'll leave all the links down below. And thank you so much for watching and always leaving nice comments. Everyone is so kind here on YouTube. I really love the community. Um, I'm gonna try and film more. It's just really hard because I have to film videos for work as well. But I will try my hardest to film more. So until um, I see you in my next video, thank you again for watching and take care.